Hey Live Leaner, thanks for tuning in this episode. We're about to get motivational up in here. I'm gonna be talking to you about one of the most powerful tools that you have in your arsenal, this big guy right up here. What's good Live Leaner, I'm Brad Guthrie and thanks for tuning in to this motivational episode of Live Lean TV. And before we do get started, I just wanna make sure that you keep an open mind throughout these motivational videos because I'm gonna be throwing a little bit of sauce at you, the motivational kind. So first, if you can't work this muscle right up there, you will never live your best life because your thoughts, they really are things. And they're not just ordinary things, they can be like the biggest bully in your life, like Nelson from The Simpsons, or they can be like your best wingman, like me. So when you combine these positive thoughts with purpose, persistence, and a burning desire to obtain whatever it is, you will turn that desire into reality. It really doesn't matter if it's your dream body that you want, your dream job, or your dream significant other. You can do it if you really desire it and you're willing to do anything and everything to actually achieve it. So just imagine for a second that you have a definite purpose and you work towards that purpose every single day, it's gonna come true. Nothing will be able to stop you because success begins with a state of mind, a definite purpose, and of course, action. People, they're just too used to the word impossible. Everyone knows why things won't work or why things just can't be done. I do not want you to be that person, Live Leaner. I want you to write down the word impossible and then just tear it up. Cut it like right out of your mental dictionary. And the only time I ever want you seeing those letters side by side is when you're saying, I'm possible because you really are. And success, it comes to those who become success conscious. And then failure comes to those who allow themselves to be failure conscious. And I see these people on my Facebook page, the failure conscious people. And I do see some success conscious ones as well. And it's all about negativity. They blame everything else for why things won't work and why things are not working for them. I do not want you to be that person. And that is the point of this video. It's to help you change your mindset from failure consciousness into success consciousness. And I know you may be saying, but Brad, I'm 300 pounds. I don't know where to start and I don't know what to do. And my response to you is fine. That that's really is fine. But just think about it for a sec. Do you really think you are the only person out there that has ever been in that situation? And do you really believe that there's never been another 300 pound person that has ever lost weight? There's people on my Facebook page that have lost tons of weight. So there are plenty of success stories out there. The difference between those people is they took initiative. They had the faith and the desire that it is possible. And most importantly, they took action and invested in someone to help them out to reach that goal. Now, one of the most common causes of failure is the habit of quitting. People just seem to quit when they face a temporary defeat. And in my entrepreneurial career, I faced so many failures. There were times where I wanted to just quit what I'm doing right now and just go back to work at the advertising agency that I worked at. But I just kept telling myself, this is my destiny. Keep working at it and I know I can make this happen. And to be honest, I'm pumped to say that this year has been my most successful ever in all of my professional career. So even if you think you tried everything, have you even asked for help yet? Did you invest in any expert advice? Because before you reach success, just trust me, temporary defeat and failure is inevitable. And of course, the normal thing to do is to quit, and that's what most people do, but it's the successful people in life that always just keep going. And it reminds me of this saying out there, and let me think I can remember this. The greatest success is just one step past the point when you permanently give up. And you know what, I totally believe that. So analyze, why are you failing? Learn from the lesson and keep moving forward no matter how hard it may seem. Because I am so grateful today that I did not give up on my dream. Once you understand this, you will succeed in anything because determination always, always wins. So what is your desire in life, in fitness, in your relationships? Figure out what it is and what you want out of life. You are the master of your fate. You are the captain of your soul. You are in control of your thoughts and if they're success minded or they're failure minded. And you do control if you take action on those goals. And don't forget, your thoughts, they are magnets. They're gonna attract the positive or negative forces, circumstances, and people into your life that will either bring you closer or further from your goal. And finally, I wanna nail home this message. 
There is no such thing as something for nothing. Anything of value cannot be had without a price. And I promise you, the price that you will pay in the form of sweat and discipline is far less than the value you're gonna be getting once you start living lean. All your successes are gonna begin with a first step. So it's your first meal, your first workout, the first time you pass up that donut at the office. If you wanna lose fat and build muscle, first get your mind there and get that intense desire that it will happen. Be success conscious and take action every single day to accomplish it. And I always tell people this, you do not need to be perfect in your journey to living lean. You just have to strive to be better today than what you were yesterday. Now I know I dropped a lot on you, so make sure you watch this video a few times and make sure you send this video to at least five people that you hang out with most because as the saying goes, you are the average of the five people that you hang out with most. And if you do like this motivational videos and you want to see more of them, do me a favor by clicking that like button right down there. And lastly, in the comment section below, what is the most self-limiting thought that keeps entering your mind? And don't be nervous to write something because we have a very supportive group of live leaners here. And once I finish uploading this video, I'm gonna actually insert that in the comment section below for me. So keep being awesome, live leaner, and we will see you at the next video. If you're a college kid, this video is for you. If you're a parent of a college kid, this video is for you. Or if you still live